future integration. So we uh, think that Germany has a responsibility to share the experience, the hope and the vision of, the, uh, of reunification. Because of this, it is particularly meaningful that a peace madame is uh, taking place in uh, Berlin. You can see the picture uh, when we were in Berlin uh, one and a half years ago to discuss about this peace train project. And this is the, uh, uh, for this time, uh, we are peace madame in Berlin, 23, 23 days ago. There are so many uh, uh, guests uh, for lectures in conference in Berlin. <coughs> After the conference, the candlelight worship service at the Brandenburg Gate. From Berlin to Moscow, 26 hours in the train. And we uh, came to Moscow. It's the Russian Orthodox Church uh, supported us to hold a conference and peace madame in Moscow. From Moscow to Irkutsk, three or five days and four nights in the train we stayed. Mm. In Irkutsk, there are uh, uh, there uh, we had a kind of life concentrating uh, conference near Baikal Lake. In Beijing. In the train, we start uh, the Bible study and have worship service and many uh, different kinds of workshop on peace. Actually, we really expected to go into Pyongyang. This is uh, Bongsu Church in Pyongyang. In the uh, year 2008, we had a uh, joint prayer meeting at the Bongsu Church. So instead of going into Pyongyang, we stood at the Dandong, border city between China and North Korea. We yeah, just saw the part of North Korea. <coughs> and uh, uh, the first stop of a peace train, the Berlin, we uh, issued a peace message from Berlin. Yeah, so we, uh, the point is that without a solution, the divided Korean Peninsula, the Cold War era will never end. Uh, I already mentioned this kind of things uh, at the uh, front, so uh, this is my uh, presentation. Thank you.